If you watch yes, not even filming. Right? If you watch yesterday's vlog, that soup I had was amazing. I know I didn't come back and uh, say anything about the soup, but I ended up eating and passing out. I got lots of sleep last night. I feel I feel really good. So, all right, let's get this day started. Let's get lots of crap done. That's that's the plan today. Let's go. I want to park, people. I don't want to get hit by anything. And I am not parking up where all this crap is going on. That is for sure. It looks safe over here. But we're here, Restaurant Depot. Time to get some uh, utensils for Colorado. I needed 10 boxes of heavyweight forks. That's all they had. Sound good and nice. I got Nick and I a bagel while I was at Winco, and I am having a grilled tenderloin bagel sandwich with pickles, and it smells and looks delicious. Hopefully the guy that's supposed to uh, take apart the dishwasher is here soon, because I have to take the motor to the motor shop, or the motor place, or the fix-it motor, motor store. <laughs> yes. You guys remember from yesterday when I showed you guys how I was really behind on the edit because I was super busy and blah 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 and it was 3 o'clock and here watch, watch this I just think this is really funny. I mean I know you guys have already seen this. It's it's already 3 o'clock. I haven't even had a chance to edit this whole thing yet. Alright look what time it is. Haha. <laughs> it's exactly the same time as it was yesterday. And I haven't got the edit done. Just got busy days. Busy days. All right, back to work. A long edit. Look, at oh, look at what came in the mail. Look at what came in the mail. Look what it came in the mail. Oh, I'm so excited. So excited. Let me get these put away. I'm addicted to these things. The Sriracha Chex Mix or Cheese It Snack Mix, whatever. I'm addicted to it. So I got two more boxes today. Okay, anyways, let's let's get this bad boy opened. Ugh. And I actually have a funny story about it. This website, what is it? Gradenroad.com. Graden as in G R Grandin. Excuse me, Grand In. G R A N D I N R O A D Road. I ordered all this stuff from them, and I spent a decent amount of money. See Grandin Road. So I buy all this stuff, and then three days later, I get an email from their website telling me that if I spend a certain amount of money, then I will save 25%. So, I spent a decent amount of money, and I would have saved 25%, so I was very irritated to say the least. Anyways, so I called the company. Normally I wouldn't care, I'd be like, you know what, I missed out. I should have looked ahead of time, but it was not one of those look ahead of time type things. It was like an email special. So I called, and uh, I tell the lady, and I was really nice about it. I wasn't being a dick. I was like, I got, I got your email. And uh, how should I do this exactly? Should I send everything back when it comes and reorder everything today so I can get 25% off? Or honestly, the easiest thing for you guys to do would be to credit my credit card. Just give me the credit. So anyways, she goes and talks to somebody and comes back a few minutes later. They ended up crediting my credit card, $90. That's how much I saved because I didn't have the email two days ahead of time. And she was really nice about it. She was like, yeah, normally we don't do this, but we'll do it for you this one time. And I was like, well, thank you very much. I was really appreciative. Like I said, I was really nice about it. But that was just crazy. I got so irritated when I got that meal, that email saying I could save 25%. So... Needless to say, I will be ordering from this website again. They have really, really cool stuff. And uh, I got a bunch of Halloween stuff. This is that magazine I showed you guys with the Halloween stuff in it. And I just want to be really careful with this stuff. 
Okay, you know what? I'm gonna... Uh, careful! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do this up on the counter and I'll just film it. I'll film it for you guys when I'm done. Because like I said, I don't, I don't want to rush opening this crap. It, a lot of it's really delicate. And Lily seems to be in, in a playful mood right now. In a playful mood right now. Silly dog. Silly dog. All right. Give me one second to open this stuff up, guys. Halloween stuff. This is the Day of the Dead bust. I thought this was going to be a little bigger, and I thought these were going to be smaller. <laughs> but I like them, so it doesn't matter. It's okay. This is the guy with his monocle. And this is the lady with her pearl necklace. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. This is going to go on that table over there for Halloween. And then these plates were just awesome. I had to get these. I really like them. And they're not like perfect circles. They're kind of like... I don't know what you would call that, but they're offset a little bit. They're like wavy. I guess wavy is a good word. <laughs> But yeah, I really like this stuff. The one thing I didn't get that I wanted to get was the wreath. And I, like, I was going to put, I mean, I still might get it. But I'm going to, I was going to put this here and hang the wreath there in the middle of the mirror. But I thought it would be too much because, like I said, I thought this was going to be bigger. But it, it's not. So I might actually get the wreath. And then I, I'm, I'm going to move some stuff around. But, yeah. I like it. The quality of their stuff is really good. I don't know if you remember those, those eyeballs I got last year. It was from the same company. Actually, here, let me show you guys. Because I, I doubt you guys remember. These eyeballs. These ones. I just kind of have them under here. It's like, like decoration. They have really, really good stuff on the website. They don't just have... Halloween stuff, they have stuff for, it's like home decor, but their Halloween selection is amazing. So yeah, that's everything I got. All right, well, I'm going to go run now. I didn't run last night. I just lifted last night, so I really have to run tonight. It's going to happen right now. I just got done eating two sandwiches, a fruit cup, and like a bazillion things of liquid. I ran a lot. And I am very tired and very sweaty. And now I'm very full. <sighs> oh, I forgot to mention it sooner. Normally Tuesdays, Nick and I go see a movie or we'll hang out here. We were going to see Sausage Party. That got canceled because I'm, um, I'm with Zoe today. Something about Autumn's or Zoe's mom's streets getting paved or something. So... Zoe is here, so then Nick and I were going to run together here, but then he canceled because he's doing something with his daughter's mom. Uh, if I would have saw a movie, I would have gotten home at like 1 in the morning, and then I would have taken Zoe to school. So I would have gotten like zero sleep. So it ended up working out. I'm happy. And I'm happy I ran because I wouldn't have run otherwise either if I saw a movie. <sighs> but yeah, I am exhausted. I need to shower and get to bed. So I think this, ah, oh, burp, is good night. Be back tomorrow. Tomorrow, I know I've been saying like for the past week that I'm going to Sam's or Sprouts. Tomorrow, I am positively 100% surely going to Sprouts. One, I have to get groceries, and two, I need to get stuff for my mom for Colorado. And tomorrow is Sprouts Day. I think I might be going to Home Depot as well to uh, pay a bill for the restaurant and to get some wood chips for the smoker for Colorado. I mean, they're doing that tomorrow or Thursday. I might just do it tomorrow. It'd probably be, it'd probably be smarter for me to take care of two of my errands tomorrow. And then Thursday, that would leave me no errands on Thursday. And then Friday, no errands on Friday. Saturday, a huge, huge trip to Sam's. But anyways, you guys will see as this stuff happens. I'm going to I'm gonna say goodnight. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Like I said, thank you for watching. Don't forget to please thumb up and subscribe. And I know I don't, I don't think I mention in the vlogs very often. We put up a new food review every Thursday. I know while I was in Colorado, I didn't put any up. But I will be putting them up every Thursday now again. 
so stay tuned for that. I think most of you guys watch the reviews, but for those of you that don't, yeah, they're up every Thursday. And uh, all right, well, good night. Thank you again for watching. You guys are freaking awesome.